Hello, PC Smoker back again. Trying to find fill over 15 minute video. <laughs> and uh, let's get started. Let's tell from the caption below. That's why I went. That's why I went um, yesterday at, when this video was made. So, tell you more about it as soon as we're done with the housekeeping. I'm smoking. All right, Alec Bradley, Texas on Cyril, Pigtail. Of course, it's seven by seventy because lost the weekend. I found it. Takes about three hours to get rid of. So now I got that much time left before I go to work. So anyway, ah. Uh, I never went to the Chicago Pipe Show, Chicago Land Pipe Show. Make that clear. I never went there because, you know, you know, I just didn't have the time to have to work every single day. And, um, I am all fuzzy here. I, well, I got rid of it. Oh, there we go. Get rid of that. Oh, focus. I don't like that. Okay, now we're see me. Now you see me straight. If you still see me fuzzy, or I had too much drink last night. Anyway, ah. so I was saying, I know with the Chicago Line Pipe Show because I never, heard, I never heard about it. And usually never go because I work seven days a week. So. And I really can't afford it since so I'm wagging minimum wage from both jobs. So yeah, never, never a shot to go to go to one. And of course, you know, last year I went down to Nashville for the for the um, Southern Fry Pop Show, and um, it was fun. I like it. May go again this year. See how much money to try and save between now and then, and um, so like I said, I don't know which car pipe show, you know, you know, it's only a three hour drive, that's all it is. But you know, I said, well, let's give it a shot. So took the day off, requested the day off, and drove on up there to throw that generally goes from my hometown all the way out, despite what, um, you know, navigation map on the iPhone says, because it wants me going the tollways, uh, sorry, two dollars I would stop, no thank you. So, you know, just went up 47, and, um, and of course, we're being on a Saturday morning, you know, it's, it wrote, everything was busy. Uh, people shopping and all that, you know, want to see movies and all that, so, you know, it was kind of a big, long drive. <laughs> Now I'm supposed to get to Yorkville. Yeah, everybody's looking on the map and saying, where's Yorkville? Where's it's in the Western Boonies. It's on the outside sphere of Chicago land. Anyway, there was a lot of road construction going on. Yorkville was going to all stop the traffic for about five minutes. And then before that, had a couple had to stop for a couple of trains passing through, and then a little bit more road construction here and there. And then when I get oh, the two roads I get to on Pipe Show, I show the 
I chose the shorter one. The one that's closest towards me. Bad choice. Because they were laying down asphalt. So, yeah, I waited about five minutes before I'd finally be able to go. And it took a, it took a while to get through it. Because, you know, it was all tarred and ready to go. Or all up and ready to go. And it's a good thing I didn't drove a good thing I didn't drove a motorcycle because you know they're all nice and chewed up and not even all that. It, it, I would have been scared to death to go on that. So even though next year be even though by next um by summer time if or in a few weeks it'll be all done. Uh I'm gonna go to, go to the drag routes to go. One uh, route, route 47, and then down 64. You can get down Pheasant Lane. That's it. Because it's only what, eight miles. No, eight miles get to St. Charles, and then of course Saturday morning afternoon traffic. Uh, everybody has to go shopping and all that. So it took about another ten minutes. So. And when I got there, and started lounging through all the tables, and um, you know, see what see what the what they all offer they have. Most of these people are from the Chicago line area. Some of down a few of them from downstate. And of course, there are those that are from out of state, like Sparky Pikes from Idaho. Of course, Joe Case from down in Nashville, and um, uh, Vermont, and of course, the Dangna Boys down in Florida, and a few other places. So I was looking around at a lot of these pipes and all that, and then I'm going to skip that, I'm going to skip that park into the Get to the tent. Okay, get to the smoking tent. And then let's just all for repeat performance. Ah, uh, make change mark, which I answer the question. Which I ask the question. You know, y'all remember Hey Grandpa the series, and. Uh, I'm the last one to give him questions, and yeah, there has been one since. You know, Mark told me no one's coming with any questions, so so I kind of feel let down because hey, you know, that means I'm the last one in the series. I don't, I don't like that. I don't want to be last. I was always last. Maybe the last one in the family dropped dead. <laughs> yeah, age one sixty-five. You know. <laughs> anyway, you know, I mean, if you have any quite, you know, three questions you want to ask Grandpa, please send them a mark. You know, don't make it the last one of the series. Don't make it the last person of the series. I don't like that. And Keith Graham, of course. We don't forget him too. So, please send any questions. Anyway. Back to what I was um, So, on a previous video, the Polish pipe was there, even though he swore he was not going to go at all. I have a feeling he would. He did. And, of course, you know, I asked him, you know, I mean, we both lost weight, all that, you know, and he said, you know, I asked him, you know, what, what's the miss most about getting thin? He said, the greasy food. To me, well, nice, good, only comes through from this line, but I miss my chubby cheeks. I like it built more like that, but that's the way it is. So, if any of you know any muscle exercises which I can make these grow, please let me know. I'm sure there's some Italian women want to go a piece of my chip. Go. <laughs> I actually have that. 
Um, let's see. Oh, who was that guy? Ah. Uh, Excuse me for a moment. I'm going to look at Marcus Ida. I. Forgot to, well, I'll see. Not for the first time I said that. Not for the first time. Cam Wiz. Um. Ah. Uh, I draw his boy. Uh, Travis. Yeah, Travis. And then, um. Who else? Ah, uh, yeah, like I said, I met Sparky Parts there for the first time. Um, of course, Boontar and Skipsy were there along with the kids. Uh, let's see. I know I'm going to miss somebody. I know. Ah. Let's see who else. Um, first timers, yeah. Uh, so also, yeah, uh, let's see. The Smoking Pipeliner, also known as Tade. He showed up. Um, Connor's Bones was there. Smoking Grandpa Bones was there. Um, and of course, Anna was there since Mark was there. Anna was there too. So. Jay Piper, that's who. Okay. He was there for saw him for the first time. So and also saw for the first time Horatio. And let's see. Uh well, there's, well, there's a few other people I, who I saw for the first time that I've seen him. And let's see, briefly met Northern Bohemian. And um just walking on by. Another person I heard on YouTube lately, and that's um, Jeremiah Sandell. Please send us a video. And you know, I don't know if I was that tall. Well, he's not tall as me, but I know I'm not going to be that tall. So, I was about, I'm going to say six, six even. I'm gonna walk on by. Of course, if I was there a lot earlier, I was spending a lot of time on the tables. I probably would have seen them. But, um, that's what happens when you kind of leave, oh, kind of go for breakfast first, and you leave at 9 o'clock, and it takes you three and a half hours. To get where I go, but you know, of course, I had made that stuff first at back home, so I wouldn't have any road issues along the way. But you know, it took longer to get to the pipe show than it, get, than it is to get back here. Well, get back to my hometown, so I can have my pizza. I mean, it only took two hours. Would take longer, but another train pass on by. And went on by after. I went on by before I got to the track, so there was no delay there, so it was perfect. Anyway, uh, let's see. Wish I could stay around for the after party, but you know I had to go back because that's right. I work on these arms here. Pressure down here. 
I especially I split it up, you know, I work the chest and the triceps one day, second day, the back and biceps, uh, third day, shoulders and the calves, and the fourth day, abs and legs. That's it. As far as legs are concerned, just basically quads and hands. That's it. That's all you're working on. And, that, and then it goes, ro and I just rotate it. I might take a day off. I do take a day off because I'm not even surprised because, you know, those are the two days once I have two jobs that overlap each other. So, ah, that makes an off day. And I told you it'd be 15 minutes, one 15 minutes long. So anyway, let's get to the strikes. Like I said, missed the half party, but, you know, from what I heard, maybe I'll stick around a little bit longer next time. Anyway, as I was saying, get to the pipe, along the pipe tables, you know, there are a lot of pipes there. You know, Gandalf pipes, um, Peterson's, you know, Peterson's with the kind of like the church war in shape style. Um, and there was a lot, of, there was a lot of pipes there, but you know, my and some Salmonelli lookalikes. But you know, my 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 the way it is for me, you know, if I want to buy a pipe, it's got to be. Yeah, it's gotta be. It's bigger. Yeah, it's gotta be enough so these fingers can barely touch, or bigger. And that's what, and that's why I buy. So I know it's looking around, looking around the tables, till I saw a pipe that said, "Buy me, buy me." You know you want me. I know you do. <clears throat> mm -mm. No, no, no. I can't do it because I just really I could I just couldn't do it. No, I resisted. Because you know the only thing I had was. Was my checkbook and um, a few credit cards was close to being maxed out anyway. So, and also, you know, kind of like saving for the um, well, hopefully, I go down to Nashville in September and maybe down to Texas after that. I don't know. So, you know, I just I save, I gotta save the money. So, by the way, then you know. Hour or two came back, and there was that pipe. I'm like, going, hmm. I really can't buy it, but then, of course, you hear the old saying from the board resistance is futile. So, after about five minutes staring at it, and one of the percentages looking at me and I'm going, I caved in. I bought it. And so, this is the first, this is from a shop in Phoenix. So, here's the map. Here it is. There we go. There it is. That is our Dece. And I know it's made handmade Italy. And kind of like how I got two dots right there on the stem. Very short stem. And so, put a little 
pipe cleaner here will be no much of a problem, but here, you know, it's about the same size as a pipe cleaner, so regular pipe cleaner, so probably have to use church church warden pipe cleaner for it. So this is my ball. It was, you know, regular price three thirty five. But I got it at the pipe shop for two seventy. So this now makes it my official most expensive pipe I ever bought. Sale no sale. So and of course there's my little middle thing right there and it's right there's a knuckle here, so it's about an inch and a half deep at least. So probably about I don't have a good meal smoke right here. Because the rest of the pipes, you know, it's kind of like 10 minute breaks. <laughs> but, you know, that's just the way it is. So, put a nice little salty bit on this one, and they'll be ready to go. And speaking of going, it's about ready to go too, because of over 20 minutes. Naturally. Um, so hopefully, you know, I'll be able to get to Nashville. And since you know, I probably will stay off the off, stay for the after 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 hours party, night like night party, whatever. So well, we'll see what happens. You know, and of course, a little brief update on the weight. I'm down the two. Well, before yes, before the pipe show, I was below 260. So I'm in the 250s. Now, well, back over, back up to the 260s again, but hopefully it'll be a bit down to the 250s. And then who knows, maybe, well, since summer's coming up, they sweat out a lot, so I may get down to the 240s. But then that would be it, because, you know, I don't want to look. How and chic, or I just got out of the trash can, but we'll see. Anyway, keep those. That's it. And of course, gotta go. So that's the end of the video. So keep those home bars burning and cigars smoking, and we'll see you sometime down the road.